Hi guys and welcome to this video where I am playing against the number one place player on Foot Champions for November on PS4. It's Bruma09. I think his name is Ali from uh, his uh, team name at the top left of the screen as you can see. I recognise his, um, his PSN name, II underscore Bruma underscore II. And yeah, I just saw his team. It's, it's an incredible team. Unfortunately, I didn't get all the clips, but as you can see there, um, he scored a goal on the 13th minute with Ronaldo. But um, I I only got from the 10th minute because I used the PS4 um, save video clip function, which only saves the last 15 minutes. So I saved uh, at the end of the game and I got from the 10th minute, which is okay because I didn't miss any goals, for, uh, fortunately. But yeah, I mean, I get a free kick here. And... Who's on the ball here? It's Payet on the ball. Put in Dybala to confuse him a little bit. What's he, what am I, what's he thinking I'm going to do? He thinks I'm probably going to move Dybala and run over it. But I'm passing to Hazard. Do a little roulette and bang it into the corner. It was so, so beautiful. It was a brilliant finish from Hazard. Um, this is the 90 rate Hazard. And for me, he is so perfect. Um, obviously, he's a lot of coins. Uh, he was a lot of coins for me, but... I mean, I don't regret buying him at all because he's scoring goals like that. As you can see, I hit the bottom left um, of the goal, so it was perfect. But yeah, 1-1. One, one. Um, Bruma had a really good team. So he had um, Ronaldo, Bale, Boateng, Neuer, Vidal, Nangolan, um Florenzi, uh, Manolas, Alaba. Um, I think... I think he subbed off Coman for Griezmann as well. So his team was incredible. But um, yeah, I had to try and do my best in this match. Um, so as you can see here, the ball on the ball. I literally couldn't get past uh, his defence at this point. Um, best defence I've played against um, for champions. At this point, I think I was 37 uh, wins, 2 losses. And... I think he was on maybe 37 wins and no losses. But yeah, I I get free kick here with Payet. Just bang it, try and go for the surprise. But um, the keeper saves it. And then this, I try to get around, but I just can't. Because the defence is so, so tight and I just didn't know what skill to do. I was a, it was two on one, so I just went out there. I think I tried to whip a ball in, but I just overran it a little, a little bit. Um... His general play is really, really good. Um, keeps the ball well, but he tries to make incisive passes, I felt, you know, in the game. Because he's got Ronaldo up front and Bill, if he if he puts in a through ball behind my defence, I am I'm gone. Um, the formation I'm playing here is a 3 4 2 1. You can see it here really perfectly. You see that line of four. Um, I feel this is you know for, the formation for me. Um, I I'd recommend you you know testing out a few different formations because most of the pros say oh go for four one two one two two or four three two one but to be honest you just got to find something that works for you. Um, but yeah, he's got the ball here. Alab on the left brings it into Bill and I think he loved doing that um, driven pass. Um, I I bang the ball out to Sterling, my captain. Over 500, appearance, uh, 500 appearances, that's the purple sterling as well. And I've got Sniper on him, uh, the chemistry style. I think it works perfectly on him because it gives him 97 finishing in-game uh, with that chemistry style, so that's pretty brilliant. Um, but yeah, here he is coming back again at me. Uh, Vidal on the ball. I knew he was going to play in there, but Chiellini, oh my god, he's so good. Um... When I I start with a four three two one. Um, if you want to see my team, I'll just go to my Twitter and uh, at me, and I'll show you. Um, but yeah, I start with a four three two one, and I switch to a three four two one uh, in game um, because it's the formation I like, and with the players I have, it's it's brilliant. Oh, that's another thing actually. Choose a formation which suits your players. Here he gets, I just was a bit sloppy there. And again, Ronaldo through on goal, no chance for the keeper there. 
96 Ronaldo. This is a 96 Ronaldo as well. I think prob I think he's the, yeah, he's the best player in the whole game. Um, no legends on PS4, obviously, so he's literally the best player on the game. Pele isn't even better than him, actually. So, yeah. 2-1, and he thought it was over, I think. 2-1. Didn't think I could come back again from that. Because, um, you know, he's he's literally ranked number one in the world. I mean, it doesn't get any better than that. Um, or on PS4, anyway. I think Gorilla's on... Gorilla got 158, but... Um, Bruma got 157. Luckily, that 157. Um, well, no, never mind. I'll, I'll, I'll tell you later. But um, Dybala gets the ball here. Hazard. And I'm just trying to get a quick goal before before the um, half ends. And I go ultra attacking, but unfortunately, the ref blows the whistle there. And there's a stats of oh, terrible. I've only got one shot. He was dominating me, but it's expected to be fair. When he's got a better team. You know, he's ranked number one. I expected to have a tough match. And I think at this stage, maybe he's changing his team around or looking at my team. Um, but yeah, for let me just stick stick at it. I like I like my formation. I don't I rarely change it. Um so just waiting for him now. So yeah, I I didn't expect him to be this good but he, oh he brings on Pogba there so he's bringing on a sub and I decide to just drop a little bit back because sometimes I think I find that when you want a goal the best thing to do is drop deeper which sounds stupid but um, it allows um, the opponent to come at you a little bit so you can attack them which is like Kind of, uh, kind of a little trick there. But he's got the ball. Little tackle by Kante. Kante, amazing in midfield. Dybala into Walker. And this is when I knew the momentum was shifting a little bit because we're getting a little bit lucky here. Dybala, look, turns inside. I lose the ball there, but it comes back to Kante. Lose the ball again, comes back. Look at this pass from Walker. Oh, my God. Brilliant, brilliant goal from Dybala. It was the pass from Walker that really sped it open his defence and if you look at the replay I think Sterling was occupying Alaba so Alaba couldn't get to Dybala in time that gave him the space to just slot it away and that makes it 2-2 here I am I was so happy drawing against the number one player on PS4 um, Pogba here Dybala playing to Sterling nothing happens from here I think no, yeah, I look, I tried, tried a basic skill move, a little um, little fake, but it didn't it didn't really work. Anyway, Chiellini, I was I, f I felt quite comfortable at this point in the game. Just controlling the proceedings, that was a bit strange. How I didn't get a foul for that, I thought that was a foul. But anyway, I play Walker right mid because I think he's got all the attributes for it, um, especially in a three four two one. And here, little skill move doesn't come to anything, but I get a free kick. Kante's on it and into Bailey. Bailey, Bailey. Um, obviously, um, got a bit scared, so I had to pass it back to Kante, but that comes to nothing. Kante into Sterling, into Hazard. Look at that ball, and look at this from Payet. Stops it, pops it, crosses it. Boom. Oh, my God. I'm 3-2 up against Bruma. Oh, my God. I was I was so happy. And and the goal, that was... That's the first time I've ever done that um, pop move and actually made it, like... Um, made it into actual goal. And uh, I was proper... I was proper, proper happy about that. Um, it's one of those skill moves that you sort of see people do at the end of the game when... The game's already won, and I actually done it in lot in the previous game before this, just for a bit of fun, just pressing it, uh, pressing R three because it's the easiest skill move to uh, to pull off. You literally just press R three, and I didn't I didn't think it would work, and it did. It was so beautiful the way he just moved it around Florenzi, um, and whipped into Sterling because I think yeah, pyatt has got ninety nine crossing with the with a dead eye on him, which I have um, so. I have Pyatt up front. 
by the way, because I feel that having a creative player in the central striker role is better than having a striker. Because I have Hazard and Sterling to get me goals, I need someone who's going to supply them with the chances to get the goals. And Pyatt does that. Um, I've got Dede on him, which improves his passing and shooting to, um, to the max, basically. He's got 9-9 passing with Dead Eye on him. And I think like 9.89 or something like that shooting. Pretty good. This is a flop of a corner. I tried to whip it to the edge of the box. Hits my player in the corner. And then um, he gets the ball. So that didn't come to anything. At this point, I knew he was going to go go for it. Because, um, well, that's what you do when it's around the 70th, 70th minute. So, yeah. Pauses it. And I think he changes to a 3-4-3 three, three or something like that. At the end of the game, I bring on my super subs, um, Quincy Promise and Anthony Martial. Um, those two, they, they are beasts. Beasts. I can't say it, man. Beasts. But yeah. I think it's really good to have, um, it's really, really good to have explosive uh, subs that you can bring on. You're looking for guys with pace, strength, agility. Um, decent shooting. Uh, I'd recommend three cheap subs: Quincy Promise, um, Entep, and Niang. Those are the cheap, cheap options. I have Entep and Promise and Martial. Martial's a little bit of an upgrade on Niang, but yeah, it's because I could just about afford him with the amount of coins I had. And also another tip, actually, is use a fitness card every single game. Cause I didn't do that in the other weeks, and that really it makes a difference. I I started doing it in, on this weekend, and um, yeah, it's crazy. I I won like way more games than the other. Well, not way more, but just a few more games than the other weeks. My record in the weekend weekend leagues um, for November were thirty five and thirty six, thirty four, and for this week I got thirty eight, which left me in the top one hundred. So I will be opening. Um, 44 informs uh, for November, which includes Ronaldo and Bale, the 96 Ronaldo and 91 Bale in there, and Inform Walker, which I really want um, because he'll uh, slip slip into my team. But yeah, uh, I will I will be showing that off, of course. Um, I'll probably stream on Twitch, which you can follow. Um, but yeah. Uh, that is a beautiful ball from Kante there. Look at this. Florenzi is f flipping rapid. I don't know how he made it back to Hazard. I think um, Hazard's got terrible stamina. So, um, if you use... What was that? That was Hazard. If you use Hazard, I just realised well, it's the 85th eight, eight, minute and the ball still hasn't gone out and I still haven't got on Quincy Promise and Anthony Martial. But anyway... It just shows that he was really going for it. And there he slides in with Boateng. And yeah, definite red card. And here he is. Boom. He's off the pitch. And it just becomes, just becomes easy now. No way he can come back into it. But 3-2, I went park the bus because I had to. Because he was going all out. And it's the only sensible thing to do. And... Um, yeah, at this point, I just had to keep the ball safe. Or well, as safe as I could, anyway. Um, but yeah, Quincy Promise, look at this. A little bit of skill. Look at this chance from Anthony Martial. And Neuer saves it. I did. I did. I swear I did everything right there. It was, it was in the corner. Just just a little um, low-driven uh, finesse shot. And it didn't go in. I think having a good keeper as well, it wins you games. Neuer or De Gea. End of story. If you if you have any other keeper, maybe actually inform Lloris, but um, I don't like inform Lloris because I've never played with him, but I don't like him because he doesn't have the long throw uh, trait. But yeah, I win three two against the number one guy on PS4. He lost only three times out of one hundred sixty. One hundred fifty seven wins out of one hundred sixty, and maybe two of them were disconnects. So I don't know. I just felt amazing. 
he's actually only lost 11 games in the whole of FIFA 17 on Ultimate Team. And yeah, that's, that's it, guys. Thanks for watching. That is my 3-2 win against Bruma. Hope you enjoy it, and I'll try and um, qualify for the regionals in January, hopefully. That's the dream, anyway. But yeah, I'll catch you guys next time. See you later. Bye-bye.